Well, the weather pushed back the opening of the National Shrimp Festival, but it's now in full swing and it's happening in Gulf Shores. WSFA 12 News anchor Sally Pitts is there live this afternoon. And Sally, how are the crowds? Valerie, the crowds are impressive. I don't know that I have seen this area this packed even at spring break. This is the line for official merchandise. It has stretched quite a distance throughout the day. Folks are trying to get their hands on that official National Shrimp Festival merchandise. This is the 50th annual festival. Here's one of those items they want to get. This is the official sweatshirt right here. It's a nice looking sweatshirt, but they told me they are already sold out of large and extra large. This is just day one of the festival. They go through Sunday. That is how busy they have been here today. And we expect the crowds to grow throughout the weekend. There are over 300 vendors here at the festival offering just about anything you could imagine. I think it's to showcase what makes this area so great. We've got local artists, we've got local musicians, local food vendors, and it's really just been a celebration. That's what it was started back in the 70s to celebrate the seafood industry. And even folks just coming together. I know folks that come together from all different states. They get in volunteer groups, they volunteer in our tents. It's just a time for the community to come together and enjoy. We have family activities and scopes and contests. There are a lot of families out here enjoying their time. You heard about that sand sculpting contest that happened Saturday. Tomorrow they will offer free lessons on the beach. It is free to get in. You may have to pay for some parking. There are some folks offering parking on their property at a charge, but the best bet is to take a shuttle in. Valerie? Hey, that sounds so much fun. Thanks a lot, Sally.